from class 11 and 12 how today's topic is how to find differential coefficient and integration of cos inverse x and this here tan inverse x aaja ko part chai cos inverse x ko derivative ra anti derivative ra tan inverse x ko derivative hamle nikalna gairi ko cha aba number 1 aaja ko number 1 how to find d cos inverse x by dx derivative of cos inverse x hamle cos inverse x ko derivative nikalnu cha jasko derivative nikalnu cha tesla let garincha yaad garau let cos inverse x equal y therefore cos y equal x by definition and Differentiating of a like differentiating garni a like cos y equal x ko minus sin y dy equal dx hunza. Asa, and yeh dekhe bujhne paro minus sin y dy equal dx or dy by dx. So dy upon dx to minus 1 by sin y minus 1 by sin y uh, cos y ko value yati sin y bhani ko under root 1 minus cos square y ho by trigonometry minus 1 upon 1 minus cos y bhani ko x put cos y equal x aba esko artha huncha therefore derivative of cos inverse x with respect to x equal minus 1 upon on the root 1 minus x square. Cos inverse is derivative of minus 1 by on the root 1 minus x square. Isko also the integration of on the root 1 minus x square dx equal minus cos inverse x plus c. Or that cos inverse x could derivative of minus 1 by on the root 1 minus x square. Isko also the isko anti derivative. Isko anti derivative yo minus it down the minus cos inverse x plus as a uh, derivative of cos inverse x in value over two number ma anti derivative of cos inverse x with respect to x. So, what you are even same, I mean, similarly, I'm going to put let cos inverse x equal y, therefore, cos y equal x different setting ground minus sin y dy equal dx this is derivative minus sin y dy equal dx now integral this is cos inverse x so saru cos inverse x dx under root cos inverse x now supposition is y dx go, dx go minus sin y dy. I have the y into minus sin y dy. Li minus li on s li and s to me integration of y sin y dy. You minus on a little bit. Our first function into our integration we have that minus is the first function. First function into integration of Second function minus integration derivative of the first function anti derivative of the second function with respect to y. Here you first function y, second function sin y. First function into integration of second function minus integration derivative of the first function into anti derivative of the second function with respect to y. Of a minus li y sin y comes up minus cos y minus you also 1 minus cos y dy over here minus minus i'm here minus y cos y minus minus plus minus into minus plus over here minus into minus plus plus into minus minus anti cos y dy y cos y minus cos y go integration sin y 
if cos y equal a, what is the value of sin y? It is easily y. Y our supposition. Y will be cos inverse x cos y x sin y on the root 1 minus x square. Let's go. Cos inverse x into x. Y cos inverse x. Cos y. Cos y x minus sin y x on the root 1 minus cos square y. Sin y equal on the root 1 minus x square also because cos y equal x. So, empty derivative of cos inverse x with respect to x equal x cos inverse x minus on the root 1 minus x square. It's like, 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 Therefore, integration of cos inverse x with respect to x equal x x cos inverse x minus one minus x square. X cos inverse x minus on the root one minus x square. Yes, good. Yes, good. Yes, good. Last try. Question number three. Derivative of Derivative of tan inverse x dx. Just go 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 derivative of tan inverse x Differentiating both sides with respect to our tan y goes on sec square y dy goes on dx. Sec square y dy equal dx. Differentiating both sides or dy by dx equal to mass here tall of 1 upon sec square y. 1 upon sec square y 1 plus tan square y. 1 plus 10 y equal x. Our supposition is 10 y equal x. So 10 inverse x equal y. It means 10 y equal x. Different setting. Sec square y dy equal dx. Or dy upon dx equal 1 upon sec square y. 1 upon sec square y is 1 plus 10 square y. Trigonometry 1 upon 1 plus x square. Isko arsa usa. Therefore, D tan inverse x upon dx equal 1 upon 1 plus x square. Tan inverse x could derivative is 1 upon 1 plus x square. Therefore, x could empty derivative. Empty derivative of 1 upon 1 plus x square with respect to x equal the tan inverse x plus cos tan. And let x equal 10 theta bar. x equal 10 y. Suppose we are going to substitute the tan theta. We are going to substitute the theta value of 10 inverse x. Sorry. Derivative of tan inverse x with respect to x equal 1 upon 1 plus x square. It means empty derivative or integration of 1 upon 1 plus x square with respect to x equal tan inverse x plus c. This much for today. Uh, next time, empty derivative of tan inverse. I'm going to empty derivative. I give one homework. For all of you, homework, please try. Please try. Who's the try only? Hola. What is the value of integration of tan inverse x with respect to x? So hint, let tan inverse x equal y. Similarly, you can do it. And you can easily prove by uh, integration by parts. Product. This must for now.